All right, so I actually didn't quit. I uh, moved to hardcore with my friend. Um, hardcore is kind of interesting right now. There's definitely a decent amount of people playing, but nothing like softcore. Trading seems to be mainly on the Discord and not on the trade site, which makes finding some very basic things, especially for a summoner, really tough. Um, so here I am with a new character. It was called Hard Golems. I was actually expecting to go Golems. Uh, someone ended up giving me an arm of King Lororic, like, and when I was in Act 1 at, like, level 4. So, obviously, we kind of shifted and went summon. Uh, still using some clay golems just for some tanks. Uh, you can kind of see the stats on the screen. Nothing to write home about. Still trying to work on the cold resistance. The poison resistance is because I found Trex in a free game. Uh, just kind of going over some of the gear real quick. So, of course, I have that arm of King Lororic, and actually, two people have given me these. This is just a really good roll. Um, it's very similar to my one I have on Softcore. Um, I found an Undead Crown. I'm not sure exactly where, but it rolled pretty strong. I just gambled this about two games ago. So, two summon skills with 20 resist all, and so that's what's got my resistance finally looking halfway decent. Uh, a friend found this on Nightmare doing Diablo. Uh, so that was huge. I mean, it's 34 resistance. I could socket it. I'm really hoping to find another one and slam it, but we'll see. I uh, found these in a free game. So 70 poison resistance and the two mana after each kill. We found that's really important on a lot of our builds. Um, I tend to spam and not play this too seriously again. Random Resol ring with some life on it. So that's always nice. Tau someone gave me or I found or it was in a free game. I'm not sure 100% will where this one uh, came from. I think we were running Chaos and it dropped from Diablo and, and I snagged it. Another res ring that I kind of just found. So definitely need some cold res. Uh, my buddy did find some trains so I traded him for those. Uh, the skin of the Viper Magi dropped off of Griswold. Uh, so this build is able to do Hell Cows and you'll see it's just a lot of random resistance charms and some lifers. Uh, kind of whatever I found, you know, we're kind of going through trying to get all the resistance cap and then we'll try and figure it out from there. But I will show you some cows real quick. So it's just spam bam damage and let them do work. Exactly the same on software. The biggest thing here is, you know, kind of want to get that feel of what playing season five will be. I uh, look like some Nat boots drop, so that'll be nice. Uh, without just handicapping myself and not using gear that I have set on mules or anything else. I mean, obviously some people have gave some free gear. There's a lot of people quitting around now. Um, there's a lot of people that, you know, have gear. There's just not a lot of people that are playing that are willing to trade on hardcore a lot. Um, getting currency is really hard this time for us. Uh, my buddy's had a lot more luck. He's playing a good bit more than me. Um, I'm playing kind of casually and, you know, continue to help people out as much as I can. Uh, but, you know, overall pretty safe. We made it to 80 so far, which is about 60 more levels than I ever expected to make it. I figured I would hit Act 2, I would get taken out by Lightning, and it would be game over. Uh, luckily kind of made it past that. I've gotten lucky. Someone rushed us from about Nightmare Act 2 to Hell Act 5, which was great. Um, then we struggled to get Ancients and Bell done, which was kind of comical. And then uh, Nice Barbarian with Last Wish actually joined the game and helped us out. So right now I'm just killing cows. Um, can do cows, can do pits. A lot of running around Act 1. Um, Shrek, Pinnacle, uh, Eldritch, you know, can, can do all those pretty well. Really, I don't know what the next plan is for this. I need trained armor. Um, I kind of feel like this thing will probably go all trains and then kind of balance out from there and see what we can get. I'm not very hopeful in getting Marowaks or Grab Palm or an Arch or anything like that. Um, I figure I'll kind of play this casually from here on out. I do have some plans to build some other characters, so I want to build the Jabs on. Uh, that's for testing some farming uh, of Arcane. Um, so I was doing that previously on a source. It gets really boring really quickly. Uh, so I'm going to try on a Jabzon. I want to see, you know, is there any improvements, anything that will 
go a little bit smoother. Um, other than that, we continue to gear this guy. I'm gonna go back and do a build recap on some of the other builds I did. Um, hopefully here, you know, we'll go over some things as well of what happens when people don't just give you items or quit. Uh, probably would have started with Spirit. Um, then I probably would have went gambling for wands. Um, Spirit's just so easy to get. I mean, I've seen, I don't know how many crystal swords at this point and all the runes. I mean, I'm pretty well stacked up. Uh, Forge was disappointing. It was a co. I found two co's and cows already. Um, my highest rune so far is foul. Need about an is it looks like, to get a train armor on hardcore. Um, so we're just kind of stacking the world's known shards. And uh, we'll see how it goes. I mean, still have the gambling itch. Still brick a lot of things. Uh, definitely can't afford to brick some things right now. So, you know, we'll hope, hopefully we find some stuff. My buddy's bricked quite a few. Bricked the Ithril Viper Magi the other day. Um, but, I mean, we really weren't planning on building an Act 3 Merc or anything. Uh, so we'll see how it goes for right now. Just at one Merc. Someone gave that in a free game. Found these, not even rocking a belt. Uh, found that and found this. Um, one thing I really like is something of this has how I want to say, or maybe not. Yeah, so this has how. Um, so if you blood warp into a pack, this is sometimes really helpful. Um, I've had to kind of save my butt twice now. Uh, I'm not good at playing super laid back. So that's one thing we're working on of really trying to teleport, get the skeleton in front of you, and get the hell out of there. Um, so hopefully we'll get better at that. Continue to learn. I mean, I think this play style is useful for going into a new ladder. Um, it's a challenge. You know, it's not like, oh, it's a give me. Like, you got to actually grind and do some work. But by having one character up, it makes life a whole lot easier, of course, and, you know, free stuff always helps. But uh, thank you guys for checking in. Um, as far as the skills, we're really pumping into Golem Mastery right now just to get some more Golems out. Um, I don't know that I'll go Iron. I mean, I guess it depends if I start finding a bunch of Mage Slayers. Um, nothing in PNB. Courses we max Amp, uh, max Skeleton Mastery, max Skeleton Warriors. We have Mages Max right now. Don't know how I really feel about them. Um, probably be better just throw that into Golem. Uh, but for now, you know, we'll leave it there. We'll see how it does. They're nice to uh, provide some elemental damage. You know, if you do run some physical immunes, that amplified damage won't break. Uh, they also, you know, occasionally kill stuff, especially in Nightmare. And, you know, free loot's always free loot. So, 